Thanks for letting me crash with you, Red. It's just until I find a new safe house. Only one condition, though. Uh, no killing while you're here, please. Oh, you know, that's the problem with you, Red. You're a half measure. You're afraid to go to the extreme and do what needs to be done. I know, we talked about this many times already, but if you're gonna stay here, you can't be creepy and intense the entire time, please. You know what? I'm sorry about that. It won't happen again. I promise. You won't even notice I'm here. It's a rough start. So, just guns, huh? Well, now I just have more questions. Tea? You're starting your morning with tea. Yeah, what's wrong with herbal tea, Frank? What's wrong with herbal tea? You ever get tired, Brad? Yes, we've been over this. I get very tired. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Well, if you drank coffee, you'd have the energy to get done what needs to get done. Frank, can we not do this right now? I just woke up. No, I don't think you've been awake your entire life, Red. Yeah, yeah, I get it. You're the only one that's awake. We're in the Matrix, and you're very awake. Congrats, Neo. You recycle, but you don't compost. I told you, I tried to compost, but it's too messy. Too messy. All right, that's your problem, isn't it? You're afraid to get dirty. You're a half measure, and your whole life is a half measure. You're afraid to do the things that need to get done to save this planet. And what you don't realize is that you're one bad environment away from being me. Frank, you're not making any sense. Oh, get out of my face. Are you still there? Okay, let's work out some of this aggression together. Uh, let's spar. <laughs> That's a great idea. Great. Yeah. Oh, God! What are you doing? What? You wanted to spar? Yeah! Hit and punch, not shoot! And shoot! <laughs> That's the problem with you. It's all half measures. You can use guns because anything goes in the game of survival, oh, man. You are this close to making me want to murder people for real. <laughs> ah! Stop shooting! Who's shooting at me? Hey, that wasn't even me. That was just my gun alarm clock. Why is your alarm clock a gun? You ever get tired, Red? Look at you, half-measuring it again. Yay, you're in this room, too. You wrote a whole sentence in capital letters, and you shipped. Caps Lock is right there, man. And you spelled maniac manic. What's wrong with you, Red? How did you get through life this far? Spell check. Oh, you make me sick. Good talk, Frank. I cherish these moments. I do. You own a house? Huh? I have a file here on Frank Castle, and it says Frank Castle owns a house. Why is Frank Castle not staying in Frank Castle's house? Because I burned it down because Frank Castle is dead. Of course. Frank Castle dies, Frank Castle burns his own house down. That makes sense. When my father died, we also burned his house down. Really? No, you idiot! That's not how a person grieves! That's how I grieve. That's how I grieve, because I go all in. Because unlike you, I am not. A half measure. You're going to call me a half measure. It happened at breakfast about 20 times, and you're going to say it again. Half measure. I know I'm a half measure. No, no, no. I was going to say that you're a partial. You, you're, you, you bring a fraction to the game it is that I play. When it, you know what? Fine. I was going to say half measure. Is that what you want to hear, Red? You're a half measure. I go all in. I burn a house down that I don't want anymore. What would you have me do with a house? Yeah, sell it. Sell it. Sell it. You sell a house. A normal person sells a house that they do not want. All right, that's not a bad idea. I hadn't thought of that. Do you ever get tired, Frank? Oh, you know I do. I brought it up a bunch. You... Now you're asking me to leave, aren't you? I have absolutely, yes. Fine, fine. Taking my gun alarm with me. Before I go, should I, uh... Do not burn my place down, please. No. Half measure. 